today we're going to talk about a very special writer, very famous writer in US history. His name is Bobby Boogaloo Shorts, number 11 and number one. Bobby Shorts, one of the great writers in US history. Bobby started racing Speedway in the mid 70s. He was just an instant D1 rider. The guy was famous from the very beginning. I don't think the guy was bad at all. He just went straight to D1. He wore the yellow and black uniform. Number 126, Bobby Schwartz. They called him the Bumblebee. The Bumblebee. That's my name. And I heard Bobby's name was the Bumblebee, and he was an awesome rider, and still is an awesome rider. He's still racing today. He never quits. Bobby Schwartz, one of the great riders in US history. Bobby is a two-time United States champion in 1986 and 1989. He's a two-time Best Pairs champion, 1981 with Bruce Penhall. He's a two-time California State Champion in 84 and 1991. Bobby's a four-time Fair Derby Champion in 1978, 1990, 93, and 94. He was a 1982 World Cup Champion. And he was the World Cup Team Captain from 1983 to 1987. I'd like to tell you a story I never told Bobby before. Hopefully he hears about it. When I was watching him race in Costa Mesa, back when he first started, I sat next to a guy who was cheering for Bobby. And I turned around and I said, you like Bobby Schwartz a lot, don't you? And he said, yes, he's my favorite writer. And I said, have you ever met him? And he said, yeah, I've met him many times. And I said, where did you meet him? He says, I am Bobby's brother. And I said, brother? Really? And I guess he was like a Hollywood hairstylist or makeup artist. And I sat next to him at Costa Mesa and he was Bobby's number one fan. I don't know whatever became of him or if he's still alive today, but I met Bobby Schwartz's brother and he didn't look like Bobby Schwartz at all, but he sure loved Bobby Schwartz. And I was very like happy to see him rooting for his brother, Bobby Schwartz.